this is all about the chin and the jaw. So I'm just about to fill out the consent form. So it's the same consent forms that I've filled out in the other videos and I will put those videos up top so you guys can go watch those. But um, this is a new location. That's the only difference. It's the same place, flawless, but a different location. so many times and like I said I'll put that in the video so you guys can go back and watch that this is all about the chin and the jaw we'll talk after
forgot my camera in my car, but now I'm at Dr. Smith's office waiting to get checked up on the second round of my chin. And I will explain all of that when I get home. Can't really talk right now, but yeah. So I'll let you know what happens. After my first surgery, I was really happy with the right side of my face. The left side didn't quite heal the exact same. So that's why I had the revision to try to get the left to match my right. And it is still healing. So it might appear a little bit swollen. Hi you guys, I just wanted to jump on here and answer a couple of the questions that I had about the chin liposuction that I had last year a year ago i was asked how i liked the results and kind of what happened after i love the results as i was saying in this video that the left side was a little bit different than the right side so um he had to go back into that same area and try to you know level it out and it's still swollen right now because i did just get this done uh six weeks ago and it was super easy you don't even have to go to sleep i didn't take any pain pills after like it was it was a breeze another question was how much did i pay um with my doctor dr smith here in las vegas i paid five thousand dollars and i have heard of like a um lower cost so you guys just might want to you know check out some doctors do some consultations and it might be a different price but that's what i paid with dr smith another question was how long did i have to wear the uh bandage on my face and he recommended that i wear it for um for the first week as much as i can and i could take it off to eat which i didn't i literally just wore it i think maybe for about like almost two weeks i just never took it off and then after a while i told him i was doing that and he was like okay um there's really nothing that the band is doing anymore um this most of the swelling goes down in the first week but it's still it's like tender it's not your full results but like the major swelling goes down so um yeah then i stopped wearing it so really just a week and then maybe at night the week after those were the only questions that stuck out to me if you guys have any more questions about that just put it down in the comments and i'll answer it for you for the fillers that i got i got in my chin um my chin is really um tender like it's super tender like i don't want to you know touch it or press it too much um here it's tender like back closer towards like my um ear area but um, I do like the results. I won't know exactly how it's gonna look for about maybe two weeks because as you can see, my lips are really swollen. I have lip gloss on that doesn't really help, but um, my lips will be going down. They're not gonna stay this big. This is not the look that I'm going for. Um, my nip, my nips, <laughs> my lips. My lips are usually like a natural size for my face. And it took me a while to get to that. Like probably like, years because i kind of switch people but um yeah i didn't show you guys that in this video but i want you guys to know that they are swollen right now and then in my chin i think we did three syringes across here so one and then two and then three my face is just a little bit sore a little bit swollen it's gonna look different after a while and then i'll have to see if i want to add to it or it's fine for now or i just didn't like it we'll see because um just like my lips will go down everything else will settle and you know it might not be that much of a difference as it is now because it's just fresh and you know a little bit swollen and i just want to say before i close out this video that this is the first real time vlog that I have filmed in a long time. So bear with me because I'm getting used to the camera again. And if you are new here, thank you so much for watching. Make sure you subscribe and comment and like and do all that good stuff. And I will be making more videos weekly for you guys. Um, I do have older videos that I wanna get up for you. I'm gonna edit and get those up like I did the Mexico video that I just posted last week. Make sure you guys go watch that. Um, but I will be adding in new vlogs here and there. Let me know what you guys wanna see. If there's something that you guys want me to film or you wanna see, or you have questions about something, want me to do a video on it, just let me know down below in the comments and I'll see you guys in the next one.